Hey, what's up? Gaming Addicts here. Thanks for taking the time. I appreciate it. Uh, first thing y'all need to do, though, is click that like button before we get started. Click that subscribe button. Click that little bell, too, for notifications. But here's what we're going to get into today. I'm going to show you how, how to cook a filet mignon. All right, so, of course, there's the filet right there, you know, just raw as could possibly be. So my ingredients that I put on it, now I just moved mine y'all so I don't have anything, right? So all I did was use some steak seasoning, very cheap steak seasoning, but it was still steak seasoning nonetheless. I put salt on there, covered it a little bit, but not too much salt. Pepper, I did put a little bit of garlic salt on there as well. Most important thing about your filet though, is to set it out 30 minutes before you want to actually cook it that way it's room temperature it's not too cold when you put it onto the skillet all right so when it's raw you put your little seasonings on there however you however much you want then just press it on in there you know what i mean and, and just get it in there nice and good you don't have to worry about the filet losing its form or anything like that uh, so just going ahead and uh, press it on in there i do mine on both sides you know what i mean and I and I, I really use the seasoning. You can see how much I put on there. So then what I do is I heat the pan to medium low. And usually if you have a number setting on your stove top, I usually put it in between uh, four and right before five, so four and a half. And then what you will do is you'll put your filet on two minutes per side. You see how I've been rotating it as I've been talking about this. What it is, it's I'm, I'm, and I'm counting it out with the stop, you know, clock on my phone and everything. Two minutes per side. And while you're doing all of your, you know, your meats out and all of that good stuff while it's waiting for your 30 minutes. Now, while I'm rambling in the background, do you hear that okay. thing sizzling? Ooh, that thing is cooking, man. Oh, my gosh. Mm. All right, back to the program. It's just gonna every time you just every side that you put it on, it's just gonna look better and better and juicier. Okay, so um, just got done just to kind of fill in a little bit of time here. It's kind of crazy. Um, Tom Brady's going back to the damn Super Bowl, y'all. What the hell y'all think about that? Mahomes is a beast. You know, I didn't watch the game, but I listened to it. But I mean. Tom Brady is just a, he's an animal, y'all. I mean, I'm a Buffalo Bills guy, so, you know, I, just, he, I can't stand him. But, man, oh, man, oh, man, like, he just keeps on showing up. Him and Belichick are not to be trifled with. It's going to be crazy. Um, what else is going on here? Who was the, what was the other game? Oh, the Rams. I just always remember the Rams suck, so it's unbelievable to me that they're going to be in the Super Bowl. I don't really know what to say about that. All I know is uh, Wentz and uh, Joff, Goff, Goff was uh, a same draft class. They both going to play in Super Bowls. Hey, that's 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 pretty that's pretty slick right there. It's only been a few years, like two years. Um, I don't know. These quarterbacks are clowning coming out. These quarterbacks are clowning coming out of college nowadays, man. I mean, they're coming in ready to just throw everywhere all the time. But, um, all right, so, yeah, it's still looking pretty good here. Uh, got a little crisp going on. It's a little dark. Uh, all right, yeah. So, again, don't forget, click that like button if you like this video. Um, I'm going I'm to I'm be getting into cooking more. Uh, you can see a couple of my older videos. I did a lot of cooking as well. I can't say a lot, but I really started to get into it uh, before things changed, and I had to kind of, like, stop kind of really making videos for a while and, and I, I'm trying to get back in it now as you can tell trying to get back to you know what what I feel like I did well which is just, just kind of just show you who I am you know so um yeah just leave some comments on the filet let me know of any good sides to go with filet honestly because I mean I cook it every once in a while I'm not a big beef eater I was just in a mood it was cheap so I got two of them for like five bucks so I'm gonna just go on ahead and and get that but Overall, you know, like I don't really eat it a lot, but if I do, I just I don't really know any sides, real good sides to go with it. If you know any recipes or any dishes or anything like that, just shoot it in the comments. I'll look up the recipe and make it and do a video on it, give you a shout out and all that good stuff like that. But I'm always looking for ideas for cooking. So even if you have anything you want to see me cook, 
just throw it out there and I'll, I'll check it out, man. And we'll see what we can do. Like I said, I'll give you a shout out on there. Maybe throw your name up on the screen or something like that so everybody can see your page and then go to your page or whatnot and subscribe. Not a big deal to me, man. I think there's enough love to give for everybody out there on YouTube. So I'll give anybody a shout out. No problem at all. So, uh, yeah, it looks like it's coming along. It looks like I'm ready to put this thing in the oven, if I'm not mistaken. Yeah, here we go. I put on my little oven mitt. So, yeah, we're ready to go. Um, I'm going to just put this in the oven. Now, for the time that I put this in and uh, for the video, I did put it in for only five minutes. Honestly, people like it like that. And so I cooked it that way just to show you, you know, what it would look like. But me personally, I really put it in for, for my taste about six minutes to six and a half minutes myself personally. So that way, the red that you see in the video you know, that's more like what, like a medium, like a medium, you know, I like mine a little medium well. So about 20% of that red, that pink that you see right here, about 20% of that is gone in about six minutes, six and a half minutes. So again, it's still got a nice pink. It's still juicy on the inside, but it's nowhere near uh, how people like, like it like this. It was still good like this. I did eat a little bit of it like this because I mean, it is tasty, but again, everybody has their own taste. My taste is a, just a little tiny bit, uh, uh, more cooked there. But again, as you can see, like this, this thing right here, mm, it is ready to go. I mean, it's just, mm, mm, mm. it was delicious. It was, it was seasoned. I mean, it was, the seasoning was cheap. I mean, I, I swear, I think it was Walmart steak seasoning. I swear, man. And, and on sale. I, I'm not even playing. But it doesn't even matter. As long as you season it right, it'll taste good. So don't even worry about that. Um, yeah, just look at this piece here. Just look at the juices. Just look at how tender it is. It's just, it's ready to be devoured. I mean, what what can you say? Like that piece right there. Like I almost passed out when I when I ate it, yo. I'm not even gonna lie. Like the taste is just, it just overwhelmed the senses. I just, I just almost just passed out on y'all just on camera and everything, man. It was so good. But yeah, look at that. Like the, it, it really don't get any better than that, though. I mean, look at that, man. Like it don't get any better than that. So yeah, that's how I cook my fillets. I mean, and I just, you know, I mean it's that simple, you know. So yeah, if you have any questions, just let me know.